come to one today called Julie's Breakfast Bar. It's on uh, St. Albans Road. I think it is in Bolton. We're going in and giving a good honest review for a bacon sausage egg and mushroom. Is that the door? The door on my ass. There it is, isn't it? Yeah. 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 Pasties. Yeah, pasties all Television. This morning on go. Lots of lunchtime op options. There's my Lucas head in there, Mark. Like. Mm -hmm. Get my Lucas head out of there. Get my Lucas head out of there. No, no, no. Here we go. Who's that? Beef. Cheese on. The egg pot's a nice touch. Uh, can we get two bacon sausage egg and mushroom, please? Yeah, I just want a yeah, bomb, yeah. yeah. Uh, red sauce and pepper yeah, on one. Brown, brown and pepper on mine, please. Yeah, so brown sauce, pepper as well. Coffee one sugar as well, please. Right then. We've got our buddies, the tradesmen. We are hungry. Right then, first thing as always, let's talk price. Eight pounds sixty. Eight sixty. All in. weren't bad. Not weren't, bad. weren't like fantastic. Yeah. It's not. They're not going to win any awards. It's wrapped in tin foil, which is a nice little touch. <laughs> <laughs> let's talk about the establishment itself first of all. Yeah, um, it's They're like nice. an American diner when you go in, sort of, isn't it? It's There's um, a bar, like a bar. The newspapers on. It's like an American diner when you go in. It's, it's quite nice how they've done it. You know, it's all like red and um, and black and things like that. You know, there's two tables. So if you do want to eat in, you have got the option of eating in in the sh in the shop. Um, they had a Bolton Wanderers fixture list on the wall, which we liked. Which we, we liked. You know, that's obviously scoring you a couple of brownie points. And we went in and we left the Bolton news and we left it open on this page. These handsome fellas here. Who's this? <laughs> <laughs> it's us. Yeah. To, to be honest, I'll throw it out there. I don't think we were made to feel very welcome. Like they didn't recognise us. They no, didn't I'm not, I'm not talking us. about recognising us. I'm talking about saying like, "Hey lads, you all right?" There was, there was quite rude, to be honest. Yeah, yeah. there wasn't much banter. No, there wasn't much they, banter. They wanted to get us in and get us out as quickly as possible. There was and no it, like, I, I don't know if it was just me. The food seemed to take ages. 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 I mean, there. I know it's not McDonald's. I know it's not fast food. I was like one off the production line. There's two people in there serving, but. Other sandwich shops, they tend to be a bit quicker. But anyway, the proof's in the eating. We're not judging before we've tasted. Let's have a look at our butter. It is all freshly made because they was in the back. Mushrooms, they look underdone. It's, uh, they it's... look underdone. Mm, they look a bit anemic. Though. Are they, uh, are they uh, <laughs> vegetarian mushrooms? What do you mean? Every mushroom's vegetarian. Are the they? white. Oh, yeah, hey, I've never had a white one before. Egg is, uh, let's have a see of the egg. A bit of brown sauce. The egg's gonna... a little bit runny. Size of the bombs though. They've done it. Bacon, sausage, egg, egg and mushroom. Jesus egg Christ, egg's been done in one of those. You oh. know those things that we spoke about? Yeah, eggs hard. It's, it's hard, that egg. Yeah, it's, it was a little bit runny, but not much. They've been done Bam's in those. Right. You know those circle it's little egg things that you crack an egg in and it comes out like a perfect circle? They've cooked it in one of them, which I'm not really too sure how I feel about that. Oh, Yours no. has been stacked differently. You've got your Whoa, sausage on the bottom. Whoa, we're different on here. What's going on? You've got your, your egg on the bottom. You've got eggs on the bottom. No, I mean, mushrooms are on the bottom. Oh. I've got mushroom, egg. Sausage and bacon. And I've got. Have you, are you holding it upside down? No, it's right where. Well, I think that's what they've done then. I think they've had my bam upside down when they've done it. Right. Holding anyway, the, the, the proof's in the eating as you anyway, say. Anyway, I'll turn it over and eat it, shall I? It's up to you. It's your body, man. Oh, the bread it. feels really soft as well, like it's going to break, like I'm touching it and it's ripping slightly. But size of bams, plenty of stuff on it. By the way, there is enough stuff on it. There's enough stuff on are it. Are we going in? Where's my egg? My egg's not been done in one of them circular things. Maybe they've only got one of them. Oh, yours. Mine's a big good. Tell you what, this is controversial. This is controversial. This mine's. Bigger. I've got a round egg, and he's not got one. Yours has been done in an egg thing. Your mine's been done in a, in a pan. Who we going in? Cause I'm starving. Yeah, come on, it. let's get in. Ready? One, two, three. One, two, three. Mm. Not much flavour to it. Bacon's reasonably nah, thick. It's quite quite well cooked. You know the bacon. I I don't like my bacon too crispy. I've just sampled the sausage on its own. Quite tasty. Quite tasty, the sausages. But when I'm eating it all together, I'm not getting much flavour. I don't know if I don't know the pepper's overriding it all or what. It smells alright. That way. Smells strong. Mm. Yeah, 
Nescafe is good. Do you reckon it's a premium brand or? Um, it doesn't taste like a Nescafe. Uh, I think it's probably like um, a Red Mountain or something like that. Kenko. Kenko. It could be Kenko. It's, it's not as... It doesn't taste as good as not, uh, the coffees I've had. Yeah, there is a lot of pepper on there. It's caught me right at the back of the throat then without me mm. expecting it. Stability is like... It's going to go this in a minute. I can feel it. Yeah, it's not very oh. stable. Oh, it's gone. Off you drop. Sausage. It's not that stable, is it? Hygiene rating, we didn't see one. Look, Google it. My eggs are boiled. Oh no. Sorry, Mark. Sorry, Bruno. Sorry, mate. my egg is are boiled. I've no fucking runniness. So, there's a bit. If I go underneath, there's a bit. I've got a bit out. I don't really uh, think the sausages are up too much, to be honest. Oh, She's come up good with that pepper ratio, though. That bacon's dry, though. Mm. Shit, the bed. Fuck me. I have had better. Produce, I must admit. Don't get me wrong. We've had. <coughs> we have had worse produce, haven't we? We have had worse produce, or chalky. We've had worse produce. <laughs> Dare we mention it, eh? Eh? About three miles up the road from here. The butcher shop that must not be named. Mm. It's like Gavin and Stacey. What did happen on that fishing trip? No one knows. Like. As a sandwich, it's all, it's, it's all right, isn't it? It's one of them what you get and you go, it's all right. I wouldn't go out my way to come here. No, I, I'd passing, only call if I were passing and I was hungry, if you have to be. I wouldn't, I wouldn't go out to my way to, to come here. We've gone a bit out of our way today for coming here, but it was recommended to us by somebody down on, on uh, Hunger Tradesman webpage. So we decided to give it a go. It got recommended by our Facebook, didn't it? Mm. Yeah, it's We've come out of our way today because we have to, because we have to give it a review, because we want to review all the butty shops. But like, we wouldn't say again, oh yeah, I can't wait till we've got Julie's. Sorry. A lot of people saying that. that we're going to have really bad hearts and stuff, but it's only a butty, isn't it? That's it, it's all we eating all day. We're having less than bloody two and a half thousand calories a day, you know? Exactly. Anyway, need a bit of Lucas here. That butty was Anyway, we've got the rating up here. What's we got? No, oh, it's just coming on now. What's they got? Hygiene rated. Do you ready? Drum roll, please. They've got a three star I rating. Three? Three. Three's all right. What's it say? Three, satisfactory. Four, three, two, St. Helens Road, Bolton. Generally satisfactory. Awesome. Let's just sum up each individual aspect of the sandwich. Price? Average, innit? Yeah, 860, I suppose, for everything in. We're never going to be. What did we have yesterday? £7.30, were it? Yeah. £7.15 we had, didn't we? Something like that. You're never going to beat Glebe Street for price because they're just giving them away. You're never going to beat 5 65 you're not. Um, coffee, Coffee's okay. It's not. I don't think it is like a premium coffee, that. I think it's more like supermarket, supermarket brand or something. You know. um, the shop itself was nice, nice decor and stuff. We had our faces in the newspaper inside, which we liked. Wanderers fixtures all over the yeah. wall. Did you have they look like a decent lunchtime menu as well. They can't be up on points for having us in paper though. They didn't put us in there, did they? No, true. <laughs> true. Bit of banter. See, a bit of banter. It goes a long way. Not just with tradesmen, with customers. We have banter with our customers, don't it's we? We have banter. To, we have cups of tea and things like that. It's important to interact know. with your customers. You don't just like fucking give them a butty and show them out the shop, make them feel unwelcome. Speak to them. Yeah, if we That's went in, did a job for somebody, but then it's right, right, pay, ta, bye. What are you up to this weekend, mate? Are you, are you doing anything? Are you busy or what? Social. Are you, going, are you going away this year? Bit of anything. Yeah, you know. So Small many butties talk. this morning, you know. <laughs> so many butties. Reviewed many butties this week, lads. <laughs> <laughs> it was weird. Mine was bacon, sausage, egg, mushroom. I think what's happened with mine? Egg, sausage, <laughs> it was, bacon. It was upside down. Oh, I don't know what's happened with it. But I think basically she thought my top with my bottom and my, my bottom with my top and he did like. I mean, I could have flipped it up, but then I've got my spongy side on bottom then, and it's it's a disaster going to happen, isn't it? It's going to fall bits, you know. And like I say, we've got to do job in a minute, you know. It's we don't want to turn up with brown sauce all down our pinny fours, do we? <laughs> <laughs> I thought the sausages were a little bit bland, personally. You said yours were all right, but it was meaty. They were blander than some we've had in past, you know. They weren't as good as a Sean's. No, no, no. Weren't as good as a Sean's sausage. Jeez, that buzz was close. Nearly hit us that, didn't it? Yeah, they weren't as meaty as Sean's. The bacon, for me, was a little bit underdone for my liking. I like it. I can't slag that bacon off because I personally liked it. But then again, we've got a different opinion, haven't we? It's, it's, yeah, all we can do is give you what we think. I mean, I like my bacon. Not overdone, not underdone. Just in middle, just right. 
You know, I, I like, like my bacon. I like my bacon so it's a little bit like. Yeah. You like it a bit like that, don't you? A bit of yeah, fat. Like he likes a bit of fat on his and stuff like that. Yeah. The fact it wasn't that fatty, the bacon. Don't get me wrong, the bacon weren't fatty. It was a bit salty. But then again, all bacon is salty because it's preserved in salt. No, I was thirsty eating that. That was dry, though. Yeah, I feel like I'm going to have to buy a can after. If I worked in there, I'd have had a bit of music on in back then. But then again, you have to pay these music fees, don't you? If you've got tables got and stuff, so you need licenses. They so. could have done a bit of singing, though. They could have done, yeah. I mean, I'd have done a bit of singing for what him. Would song? What would you have sung? I'm still standing. Carry on. I don't know, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> is there any song that you do know that you'd be up for giving us a quick blast of? Um, a bit of David Allen Co, yeah. Go on then. Give us a bit. Do you want me to give you a beat? Well, do you know you, what it, you start the beat and I'll carry yeah. it on. You do that. I was drunk the day my mama got out of prison. And I went to pick her up in the rain. But before I could get to the station in my pickup truck, she got run over by a damn old train. Then I stand around as long as you will let me. I reckon that's enough. No. That's enough, I think. <laughs> yeah. yeah, hope you enjoyed that. But yeah, if we right. had a body shop, that's what would be going on. So we'd probably get no customers, would we? So we've had price was average, hygiene, average, quality of the ingredients, average, because some of it were good, some of it weren't so good. Structure, whoa, shite. Yeah, mine, mine fell out. I'll be honest with you, mine, mine fell apart. My hands are a bit like sticky and stuff. Yeah, now. it I fell apart. It was slight. It wasn't. It wasn't overly greasy. You know, it was banter. Zero. Yeah, there was absolutely no banter. Not much customer service on go, which Zero. maybe they're not aiming for the tradesman market. But we're tradesmen at the end of the day, and somebody don't know. I would say, if you're passing, you're hungry, call in. But there are better places around town. That I've, had, that I've examined. And on the count of three, we're both going to give it what score we want to give yeah. it. Ready? One, One two, two, three, six. Six? six. Not often six. that happens, that. Not often it happens, but we are in total and utter agreement with that sandwich. Julie's Breakfast Bar, St. Ellen's Road, you score a six. Better than average. Yeah, better than average. We've given you some points there that you can improve score, on. By the way. You can improve on those points, you, and we will come back and give you another review. And we'll come months. back and say, sample something off your lunchtime menu at some point. Yeah. So it's been nice to eat you to eat your nice Julie's. And we are the hungry tradesmen and we are full now. We'll see, see you, you next time. time.